What's going on, Random Community? It's your girl, Randomly Angie, and I'm coming to you with a slow-cooked Cornish hen. Now, you know, we're going to go ahead and start off with a thawed-out um, Cornish hen, and then we got black pepper, salt, vegetable oil, we got a crock pot, we got some diced onion, then we got some cut-up potatoes, got some, uh, what's this, green pepper, sage, thyme, rosemary, cinnamon sticks, apple, we got some... Uh, cherry tomatoes and mushrooms now that's the whole lineup now you can do the crock pot at six hours or if you're gonna do like i am because i'm a little bit just kind of flush throwing the vegetable oil and i'm just gonna put that on four hours gonna throw in my potatoes then we're gonna go ahead and plant some onions and we're gonna go ahead and drop oh well yeah get the last bit last bit all right and then we're gonna go ahead and throw in the tomatoes and we're gonna throw in some mushrooms which we're gonna crush up by hand because we just want big chunks because we just want flavor from everything that's going in here with the bird so we got salt and pepper we're gonna go ahead and toss that in there and then we're gonna go ahead and mix that up nicely next up let's see about this uh, throw in some pieces of bread all because I just wanted to pick up some of that juice and thicken up and so we got our chicken broth uh, look, I don't care as long as it's chicken broth. That's all that matters. I don't care if it's range free gluten free salt free whatever Give me some chicken broth Now we're gonna throw in some fresh rosemary gonna peel that off the stick throw that in there Then we have some fresh thyme also um, Just peel the leaves off of the sprig throw that in there. Then we got the dry sage And mix that up now we got our Cornish in, now we're gonna go ahead and dry it off and then we're gonna throw, go ahead and throw in all our ingredients that was on the plate. And throw a little bit of oil in there and then top it off with salt and pepper and a little bit of that vegetable oil. Go ahead and just lather that up and toss it into the crock pot. This is how it's looking. We just throwing the rest of what was on the plate onto the into the crock pot so we can just get as much juice, flavor, all that we can. Throw it in there. And, um, you know, throw a little dry seasoning on to almost forget about the sage and let it sit there. Now, this is about two hours later. And this is about the fourth hour here. So now our bird is done. Done. Look at all that juice. Look at all that flavor. Yes. So I say happy Thanksgiving, everyone. And don't forget, enjoy your bird. So don't forget to hit the follow, the subscribe button, the like button, and follow all the social medias. And I'll check you next time. Thank you for watching. Peace.